Hey y'all, welcome back to CJD Sandler's Girl! All cases you heard today are strictly for entertainment purposes only. No shade, no read, just ain't obvious. So, with that being said, first on the docket! What's happening, YouTube fam? It's your boy Drizzle. Boy Drizzle. Boy Drizzle. It's your boy Drizzle.
again with another video. Y'all go hit that like button, girl. Share, comment, and subscribe. If you've been before, welcome back. If you're new, welcome to my channel, baby, y'all. Let's get to express. Let's go. Christ, Heavenly Father, I want to thank you for the food I'm about to receive. May it be noise to my mind, body, and soul. In Christ, your name is I do pray. Ain't a man. I am so hungry, y'all. I haven't eaten all day. Um, let's try this puss, girl. Can y'all get the first bite of the puss? Okay. Yeah, let's get some of that lemon on that girl. Now, I've never had cooked octopus whole like this before, but girl, I ain't feel like doing all that damn cut. Okay. All right now. Got me some Heinz cocktail sauce. Yeah, it's like I should have been had this shit open already. Squeeze me out. I ain't got nothing. I can just pour it in, girl. So I'm just pouring it on the side. Okay. A little bit of hot sauce with it, girl. It's good too, girl, with that Louisiana seafood. Um, shit I use, y'all saw it. Yes, honey. All right, let me just move this lemon. Wow. Pretty good. Oh. Hey y'all, y'all take the first bite of just camping. Gonna do some of that. Hope y'all can see that. Girl, let me push you to the side, push. I don't even know where to begin with this. You know I'm gonna start this lemon. Girl, lemon to me now just go with everything. Up two to the side because I don't know how much I'm gonna need. I'm ready. Now, y'all know I'm a big hot sauce fan, but I'm a weight burn. This shit gonna get messy. Doug Lawson tells telling me it's off the chain. And I didn't even have to season it. I mean, it's smothered in that scanty sauce, but I had no seasoning to it. I just steamed it and cut that bitch up. Mm. Mm. Got my Yes, 
you know, the feature for it. I put it as an intro for my video. Hmm. So look y'all, I'm finna go get ready for this. I don't wanna keep y'all too much longer. I hope y'all enjoyed this video and this recipe. And I hope y'all stay tuned and enjoy my CJD's Chamber segment. So, sit tight and stay tuned, y'all. All rise, the Honorable Chef Judge Drizzle presides. Hey y'all, welcome back to CJD Sandler's Girl! Welcome to CJD Chambers, docket number 521-2021. All cases you heard today are strictly for entertainment purposes only. No shade, no read, just ain't obvious. So, with that being said, first on the docket, we the people versus Jovan Colazzo. How the fuck you say his name? School bus still in ass. This retarded bitch is being charged with hijacking the South Carolina school bus with 18 children aboard while carrying around the bitch. You was fucking out of one. According to 10 year old Keandre James, who was one of the 18 students, aka children, on the bus, he said he heard yelling and cussing in the front of the bus and spotted a man with a rifle. Keandre said the gunman was telling the bus driver to close the doors, take me to the next town over, go, 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 shit like that, Keandre told ABC News. Keandre called his parents and told them that he was being held hostage and they freaked the fuck out, bitch, I would too. When the government told the kids to move to the front, Keandre then put his phone on silent, put it in his pants, and put his jacket over it. All right, that's what I'm talking about. Smart ass kids. Somewhere closer to the next town over, the government made everybody get out. Neither the bus driver or the 18 kids, aka children, were harmed. But I'm sure their heads were traumatized and fucked up. The bus hijacking bastard was eventually taken into custody and authorities found that his rifle didn't even have ammunition where they found the bus, you know, and the gun inside after he abandoned it with the gun inside. So your fake set it off as hijacking school buses with kids and shit inside, bitch, with fake rifles, bitch, you was fucking out of order. <laughs> bitch, it's time for your sentence. The order is to bound both your hands and feet behind your back while laying face down on cement concrete, bitch. With the same bus you hijacked, with all 18 kids and the bus driver the boy, run your ass over, bitch, with some flat rims so you can feel the rim. And let's see how you fake that shit, bitch, in that order. And then leave that roadkill bitch to the vultures. That is the order. Pay our call, cost five fees, motherfucking case call that case. Next up, like it. We the people versus Derek Dirty Ass Chauvin Girl. Now we all around the world have heard, seen, or followed the murder of George Floyd by this pink dirty ass bastard. This racist ass pig smelling ass saltine was charged and convicted of murdering George Floyd during the arrest on May 25th, 2020. Second degree murder. Third degree murder and second degree manslaughter, bitch. Guilty, guilty, guilty! All charges can carry a sentence to up to 40 years. Bitch, you deserve every damn second of it. Because if it was up to me, bitch, I had another zero behind that 40. 
This ugly ass long neck pink bitch was one of the four officers involved in arresting George Floyd on the suspicion of using a fake $20 bill at a market and also was the field training officer of one of the other pigs involved. So bitch, you mean to tell me you had a tight nuts pants wearing ass pig rookie out there on his training day and your fuck ass out there thinking Denzel Washington bitch, stop! Oh. Camera footage did not show George Floyd resisting the arrest. The criminal complaint stated that based on body cam footage, George Floyd stated he was claustrophobic, fell to the ground, and refused to enter the police vehicle. During the struggle, George Floyd appeared to turn his head to address the officer multiple times. According to the complaints, he told them, I can't breathe. Chauvin Flamingo neck ass showed up moments later with that damn pie-faced, low man, eating ass dog, cat cannibal minutes later to assist with the arrest. So was the pie-faced the one you was trying to corrupt Flamingo Nick? He was fucking out of order. Chauvin pulled George Floyd from the other side of the vehicle and onto the ground. Floyd was on the hot ass pavement, face down, handcuffed, and surrounded by shit-smelling pigs while Chauvin's knee was directly on Floyd's fucking neck and pinned for over eight fucking minutes. <laughs> fucking out of order. This motherfucker is out of order! George Floyd repeatedly said he couldn't breathe. Please, officer, he even called on his deceased mama to come help him. Y'all need to be shot. Y'all motherfucking head with a 21 gun salute. <laughs> Bitch, girl. Mm -hmm. The final two minutes, Floyd was motionless and had no pulse. Several bystanders took video, which widely circulated and broadcasted, mm. which was definitely should have, and it did. All they fuck ass was fired the next day. Fast forward to present time. Um, the other three garbage eaters are not being charged for that bullshit, and now we're gonna be hanging all y'all motherfuckers at high noon soon to pitch in that court. As for Derek Chauvin, Flamingo neck ass bitch, we know your motherfucking mouth dropped when that verdict was read guilty, 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 bitch. But I was dropped when your motherfucking knee was on George's neck for over eight minutes, motherfucker. It was out of order. I'm gonna send your ugly, smelly ass to have the world's tallest politician nigga, Robert Carnegie, who stands at 6'10. I don't know how much he weighs, maybe a little over 200 pounds, maybe 250. You know, to drag your ass to the bicycle of, of jalopy, slam your punk pink ass on hot ass cement roll, bitch. While next to an Exxon Mobil semi truck exhaust pipe with Robert Carnegie's knee on your motherfucking neck, bitch. While I handcuffed just like your punk ass did George Floyd, bitch. Your raggedy ass will remain there for 24 hours. Somebody get robbed with a mask during this sentence. Oh. And let's see how long your shitty smother ass will last, bitch, in that order. Yeah, I'll call cost fine speed, motherfucker. Case closed, that's hey! That's what I like that! We the people versus crater face, Kimberly, smelly, push, smelling ass, porter, incest, bread, horror. You are being charged for the shooting of Dante Wright. Hmm. Bitch, you fucking out. Dante Wright was a 20 year old African American killed yet again by another illiterate racist bulldogging ass skin palace pancake batter Pinkley. Dante Wright was fatally shot during a traffic stop by this horror who claimed she meant to pull out her taser and accidentally put out her gun and this horror claimed she was in the force for over 20 years so bitch we the people want to know how the fuck you mistake your damn fully loaded pistol which obviously weighs more than a taser. Bitch, I know that and I don't even own a gun. Or a taser, bitch. And that ain't Judge Drizzle making that fucking statement. <laughs> bitch, 20 years plus on the squad? More like 20 days. 20 minutes. 20 seconds. Right off. Dante was shot once at close range to his chest while they were attempting to serve. An outstanding warrant. Two days later, Kimberly Grimley asked Potter and Center Police T. 
Tim Gang resigned. Pussy pink smelling ass Potter, or should I say Potty, was arrested and charged with second degree murder and has since bonded out. Bitch, no ma'am, bring that horror back, bond revolt. No trial needed. Bitch, I'ma send your ugly ass, I'ma send your ugly crater face ass bitch, looking like your sister from the movie Monster. Fuck ass to be tased, like he tried to tase Dante, but we ain't mistaken the motherfucking taser for no damn gun, bitch. You dummy whore. Stand this whore in a puddle of water and tase this whore to her skin as dark as Dante's rights. Better yet, mine, whore up. In that order. Hey, I'll call cause finds be horror. Case closed, that's hers. That's what I get. We the people versus the P or Pete involved in the shooting death of Andrew Brown Jr. Y'all smelly ass shit smeared ass crack having ass pigs are being charged for the bullshit y'all fuck ass is always pulling. Black man killed while serving a warrant, bitch, for Andrew Brown Jr. For drugs. Yeah, bitch, y'all trying to get high off somebody else's shit for free, motherfucker. Y'all have order. <laughs> Andrew Brown was shot five times and once in the back of his head. His family asked why they have to use such deadly force while serving a search warrant. According to the forensics, the fatal shot was to the back of his head. Brown was also shot in his arm four times. Police recordings such as body cams aren't automatically classified as public rec records in North Carolina, as in some other states. A judge has signed off to have this footage released. Who that judge? I don't know, he ain't graduated in my class. City manager Freeman said he understands the family's frustration at seeing that short ass, tired ass video of y'all having coffee and eating powdered donuts. Ooh. The case was later justified as they say Brown tried to run them over. Bitch, I really wish he would have, bitch. Cause I'm so sick of y'all motherfucking asses coming in my courtroom, bitch. Y'all fucking hot water. The order is to throw all y'all fuck ass into a pot of boiling water of 200,000 degrees, bitch. It's time for a saltine boil, bitch, in that order. Somebody get some old bait. In that order. Yeah, both cars find speed, motherfuckers can't go, that's crazy. Court is adjourned. Thank you all so much for tuning in this week. I hope y'all enjoyed this week's segment. Y'all comment down below if y'all did. Y'all um, let me know some more, you know, tea that needs to be spilled or whatever, child. Because it's a lot of fuck shit going on, y'all. But like I always say, y'all, laugh as God's gift on this troubled ass world. Till next time, try to laugh. Case closed, next case, let's speak on the oil. Pay out for a cost, find speed, thank on this case! Well, y'all, that's all I got for this week, y'all. Thank y'all so much for tuning in. I hope y'all enjoyed. Follow that recipe. You know, uh, comment down below. Share, comment, like, and subscribe. Also, check out me on Facebook, Twitter, Instagram, uh, Snapchat, and all that other shit. I'll put it all up there, girl. You, you see it all up there. But anyway, I love you guys so much. Thank you so much for the love and support. Thank you so much for all the views, y'all. I'm getting a lot of views, but what a subscribe said. If y'all watching it, please subscribe. Share, like, and comment. But anyways, y'all continue to stay safe out there. Y'all get those vaccinations. And uh, continue to wear those masks. Okay, we ass is going to come. All right. But anyways, y'all, like I always say, in the meantime, y'all behave. Stay prayed up. And you like the watch watch.